What's going on guys? This is DJ with All Day DFS checking back in with y'all and I hope y'all guys had a great night last night. I hope y'all guys cashed in once again. Like always, let me know down below. Let me know down below if y'all guys cashed in. Let me know who brought it in for you. Let me know if you had some bums of the night. Multiple bums, you know, like we always say. Let me know how it went for y'all guys. If this is your first time watching a Price Picks video, guys, Price Picks is the way to go. All you're doing is picking the over or the under. That's it. It's just you versus the house, not you versus the sharks, not you versus 100,000 lineups. Now you have no chance of winning. This this is a lot different. You do have a chance of winning, a better chance of winning, in my opinion. And I think these these kind of games are the way to go. So all you have to do is sign up with the promo code all day, as you can see right there, the promo code all day. You sign up with that promo code, and uh, Price Picks will give you a hundred percent match up to a hundred dollars. So if you throw in a hundred, they'll give you a hundred, and now you're off to a good start to get these games going. So yeah, guys, last night wasn't too great. Uh, not for me. I. Uh, I about broke even. I had a, a late winner on, on another site that, that kind of saved my night. But on um, price picks, it was not good for me. Uh, and it seems like, you know, I, ha I got a lot of picks right. But I just, you know, used them in the wrong combinations. I, every every line had like one guy missing, two guys missing. If I did a flag. So it just wasn't, wasn't a good night for me. Sorry I couldn't make a video yesterday. I decided to spend the whole day with my son and do some stuff with my son. Um, you know, every, every once in a while, it's good to, 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 you know, take a day off or take, you know, at least a, a half a day off from this because it's, it could be overwhelming at times. A lot of information, uh, a lot of emotions. Obviously, if you, if you're winning, you, you're happy. If you're losing, you're not too happy, especially if you make a, you know, trying to make a living off of this. Um, so it's always good to take a, a step back and, and, you know, have a good, you know, family, family life balance or whatever. So that's what I did yesterday. I played light last night, but again, it wasn't a good night for me. I hope y'all guys had a better night. <clears throat> so today, uh, it's only a three-game slate, and I, to be honest with y'all guys, I really don't like nothing. I couldn't even get five picks. I'm not going to give y'all something that I'm not going to do is just give y'all picks just to give them to you. It's something that, that's halfway decent just so y'all can get them wrong. I'm not going to do that to y'all guys. I really don't like nothing at all on the board. There's, there's just not that much value. There's only three games. And the lines are tight. Price picks has the lines pretty tight. So basically, t tonight looks like it's going to be a guessing game. A lot of these these guys are like you know 50-50. Whether they go over or under, there's not there's not too many where it's like oh, uh, you know he's gone over nine out of ten, eight out of ten. This is a this is a lock. I don't see to be honest. I really don't see a lock on the board. Uh, maybe I didn't dig deep enough. I just uh, from what I looked at, I, I really didn't like anything. Let me know what y'all guys are liking. If y'all see guys see something. Maybe more on fantasy score you might like. But to me, it was just like, it looks really, really tight. And then you have some good players playing, but they they have bad matchups. That That's the other thing. Like, you know, okay, this guy looks decent on the assist, but then he's playing a team that doesn't, that's number one and, uh, you know, that doesn't give up assists like that. So it's like a bad matchup. So it's like, it's iffy. Like, I'm not going to try to play a, a player on a certain prop when that team's number one versus that prop. I mean, that's just, to me, that's not smart. So there's just not really hardly nothing at all that I'm liking today. It's going to be more uh, for everybody. I think it's just going to be more. This is like a gut day. You're going to be like, it's going to be your gut. Do you think this guy can get over that? Because the research just isn't there. There's not there's not enough value to me. So this is the only stuff that I have. I don't even have enough for five picks, guys. I just, I really don't like, like I said, I don't like it. Um, I'm going more of what the, the odds are saying. Um, you know, if something's heavy, heavy on the over. Um, what I first, what I for like first is Anthony Davis over two and a half assists. I mean, as you can see here, he's gone over four out of his, uh, well, actually three out of his last five. So you see the the hit rates are not, are not great. It's a sixty percent hit rate for his last five. He's projected for three point two. So <clears throat> I like Anthony Davis over two and a half assists. There's just not really too much. He is seven out of his last ten, so he has a seventy percent hit rate. And Memphis is 27 versus assists. So there is that. So um, his last five isn't too great of a hit rate, but his last 10, he's gone over seven times. And Memphis is 27 versus assists. So give me Anthony Davis over two and a half assists. And the next one I like is Royce O'Neal over one and a half threes. I was about to say, please don't tell me he took him off the board. <laughs> As you can see here, he's gone over four out of his last five. They have him projected. Uh, uh, I don't know. Oh, they don't have him. His average last. I'm sorry. His average last five is two point two. Uh, and again, he's gone over four out of his last five. So this is one of the best ones that I found on hit rate, eighty percent hit rate. 
There's not much else to it. Just four out of his last five. The odds have him going over. The odds have him hitting over one and a half threes. So I like it. There's not much to like today. I'm playing very light today. It's going to be another day that I kind of take off. Just play light and and go with it. Um, next I have Monte Morris over three and a half assists. This one's another one that doesn't really have the research to back it up. As, well, as you can see, his last five he did average four, but he has you know he had two and he has another one of two. So it looks like after he has a two a two assist game, he he came back with a good one here. Um, so give me Monty Morris over three and a half assists. I'm hoping that he can get us four. He's averaging four point four his last five. Again, not too great. My advice for today, guys, is. You know, if you like something early, lock it in. But I would wait right before tip off for all these games and see if there's somebody get get scratched last second. That'll probably be the best bet. That'll probably be your best lock if you can catch, you know, whatever it might be. You know, if, if Joker Jokic gets scratched or LeBron James or somebody like that, and and you hurry up and you get and you get the these guys before they they uh, they bump them up. That would probably be my best advice for today. It's just not looking great to me. And that's all I have. I just have those three picks that, that I like, that I picked out. Uh, remember, free throws are going to come out later. They might put some more players on the board or more props from players on the board. Um, I was liking Joel Embiid on assist, but they don't have him on assist. He was, he's was he been on a 100% hit rate from that, but they didn't put him on the board. So if they put Joel Embiid on the board at 3.5 assists, which is what his line, his line should be, uh, I would lock that in. That one looks like one of the best ones on the day. But, I mean, it's just... I mean, we took a chance before on Bojan. Bojan on one and a half assist, and he didn't get there. But as you can see there, um, far to his last five, he's got over one and a half assist. So guys, today is just gonna be more of a gut a gut day. You're gonna have to come to the, come to this board and be like, okay, you know, he's averaged this the last five games. I really think he can get there. But you have to look at the matchup. Look at the matchup as well. You know, Philly going against Utah. U Utah is one of the best defensive teams. So it's, it's going to be rough. It's going to be rough. Uh, the rebounds, I see were in favor of um, they had Joel Embiid and Gobert. Embiid and Gobert uh, are supposed to go over on the rebounds. So that's something to look at. If I had to pick between them, I think I would pick Embiid just because he's at 10.5. I think he can still get 11 boards against Gobert. You know, Embiid's the superstar. They're both going to have to rebound for their teams. Um, I like Danny Green. I just don't know how many minutes he's going to get, but I do like Danny Green on the points. Um, another one to look at is Ty Tyrese Tyrese Maxi under. Ever since Embiid came back and they've been more at full strength, he hasn't really got to this number anymore. Um, and again, guys, I'm just sorry that I can't be more helpful for today. It's just like I said, I'm not going to give you something that that's not going to hit. You know, uh, the three pointers. I mean, if and this is like I said, not everybody's on the board. They don't have no no San Antonio Spurs, so maybe throughout the day they'll put Derek White. If they put Derek White at one and a half, that'll be my favorite player of the day. I know he didn't hit the other day, but he's shooting them like crazy. He's shooting about nine, ten a game, I think. I mean, all he has to do is get his two. So if they put him at one and a half, I like Derek White over one and a half. If they put Doug Doug McDermott at one and a half, I like him over one and a half. So just look out for that. Um, I think it might be better to play NFL. I'm gonna look into the NFL tonight. It might be a lot better to play the NFL. I just don't like nothing on the board today. And I'm sorry for that, guys. But I hope. Uh, let me know if y'all guys are liking anything. Let me know down below if what y'all are y'all are liking. And uh, guys, the the Patreon is is about ready to go. We're just finished doing the last the finishing touches on it, making sure the data updates correctly, and 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 what we're giving it to you, it, it works right away. And once we have that, it'll be uh, it'll be official time to launch. Um, so look out for that as well. Please don't forget, don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Hit the bell notification so you can be notified when these videos drop. I appreciate y'all, and I, I hope y'all guys had a, have a great day, great day today and cash in. And let me know how it goes. Let me know. Let me know what y'all are liking. Have a good one.